cancelled. Sweezy. Do you kiss your friends with benefits goodbye? I've been seeing this girl for the past week, and we get along pretty well. And soon enough, we hooked up. It happened again yesterday, and I slept over at her place. We cuddled the whole night. Now, when I left, I kissed her goodbye, but I wondered if that was giving her the impression I wanted more. I'm actually not quite sure if I do, but I don't want to rush things. So, to come back to the question, is it normal to kiss your friends with benefits goodbye, or would that be weird? So... My fellow American, I don't know if you're American, my fellow friend, uh, my fellow schwoke lord. Um, this is the type of guy you get. I'm starting to think that you said you said you did. Yeah, you did kiss her goodbye. You left, you asked her if you wanted more. Um, he, it's, you're going with the very, very big question of he's being a friend with benefit. Like, does being a, someone with friends with benefits, is someone going to catch feelings? Because that's a very common thing with friends with, being friends with benefits. It's like, it's an okay thing to be, but it's kind of hard, hard to maintain over time. Because eventually, either you're going to, like, actually be like, let's, let's, let's try this out. Or, or... Because the brownie! You, uh, you actually, one of you doesn't really like the other person there. It's just for the, the sex. And they find, actually find an actual person they want to be with. And the other person starts feeling bad and shit like that. Um, so, so yeah. Uh, what I would say, though, is if, also the cuddling thing. I don't, I don't know how many people, are, I mean, how, the whole night, you cuddled the whole night, the whole night. I feel like that's a that's a relationship thing. Relationships get cuddled the whole night. Friends with benefits, it's like maybe an hour or two afterwards. Before you know, you gotta warm women up. You know, I'm the foreplay king. You know what the fuck I'm talking about. So, so yeah, that was what I would say. The, the, the whole night, and then you kissed her goodbye. It sounds like you both are getting to a relationship. So I can't speak on her feelings. She didn't write this question. You wrote this question, so you can talk about your feelings. Um, so you got to ask yourself, do I have feelings for this girl? And now, here's another question. Would you kiss a prostitute goodbye? Because, because I wouldn't, if, unless I got feelings for her. Which could happen. I'm not like saying I'm not trying to act like a better person here. <laughs> like that possible that could happen. We're like, so we're gonna like hang out again sometime. <laughs> I'm just laughing out of insecurity. Uh, so yeah. So you, I guess you have to ask because you cuddled the whole night, and then you kissed her goodbye in the morning, uh, and you're wondering if you're giving off the impression you like her, buddy. Uh, you need to ask yourself. Do you like this? And then you have to figure out if she maybe has got feelings for you, too. I think you both mean maybe once you both, uh, yeah, so that shit, no, it's not a good idea. Don't don't be kissing your friends with benefits goodbye. It's kind of like a, all right, all right, I'm going to leave. Have fun. And then you, you just leave and bounce and, you know, and stuff like that. And you're like, I'm going to go get, I had sex. I'm going to go get some nachos. I'm going home and stuff like that. It sounds like you're doing uh, relationship sex stuff. And now... There's nothing wrong with relationship sex, I have to say that. This guy is, uh, sounds like you both are having relationship sex. Which, honestly, I'm gonna say this, some of you think I'm talking shit. I think relationship sex is probably the best kind of sex. Because I think sex when you care about someone, or as I like to call, fairy tale lovers in the sheets. I like to say in some songs. Um, so anyways, though, uh, that's the best kind of sex. And, uh, you should probably figure out where you are in your life. That's pretty good. Hey there, you just checked out a highlight from Cancel Sweezy. Thank you very much. I'm glad that you learned something and that you are now a smarter individual. Uh, just so you know, we have full episodes and other many, many highlights available now. Uh, click here for the next best thing that you can go check out as well. And uh, make sure you press that subscribe button and press that notification bell. That way you get updated anytime we make a new post or any time that we make a new highlight or full episode. So thank you, honk if you love butt drugs, and stay awesome.